Today, we're going to create a calculated property in HubSpot that's going to measure the difference between two date properties. So I'm in my portal, I'm in my settings, I'm in properties. I'm going to go over here and create a new property. I'm just going to put this in contact information and I'm going to call this time between first and last conversion because those are the two properties that we're going to use here. This is going to be a calculation property and I'm going to build my calculation. So up here, I'm not going to use an equation. That's for another day. Today, we're going to take a look at this time between and then I can simply pick from any of my date properties that are in HubSpot. So in my case, I'm going to say first conversion date. Yep. And the end date is going to be the last conversion date. Whoop. It's a recent conversion, my fault. There we go. And now I can actually add a condition as well and say, we're only going to calculate this property if these other things are true. Um, you can use this, you know, with any of HubSpot's standard date properties or any of your custom date properties. And what this is going to do is any contacts that have both of these values in your database, it's going to just give you a number back. And this can be super valuable when it comes to, you know, wanting to increase things like lead scores or determine how long are your average sales cycles or how long are your marketing cycles. Um, we'd love to answer some questions about it. So please reach out.